I'm a veteran who proudly served the United States Army for more than 13 years, with two tours to Afghanistan under my belt. I believe no matter what, veterans should stick together, even with our disagreements in politics. Now I am calling for all veterans to come together and demand that President Trump show the recently departed Senator John McCain some respect and dignity, especially for his honorable service to our country. It's no surprise to me now that Trump has no respect for veterans. His worship of our flag doesn't cut it. He wanted a parade that was supposed to support the military and veterans, but in reality it was there to boost his ego, which shows no respect to veterans. And most of all, dodging the draft five times brings no honor to Trump and his fake love for the military. The list goes on, but this is about Senator John McCain. It's okay to respectfully state your opinion on how he did as a senator, but these personal attacks go on and on. This incitement of hate from Trump encourages his supporters to bring that hate towards McCain's family, particularly his daughter Meghan and his wife Cindy. As stressful as losing family members can be, they don't need to be trolled with hateful messages, tweets or articles. I have learned in chaplain assistant school that one of our primary roles in the chaplain corps is to honor the dead. I am calling on all veterans to come together and demand that Trump stop these hateful attacks on John McCain. These attacks are a disgrace to the Oval Office, to our military and veterans, and to our country.